Hey y'all, it's Taylor from Tattoo Teacher Plans. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a memory spread for Christmas week and I'm using this kit from Caress Press called Christmas Baby. It's really adorable. I like it a lot. So I do have the um, girl add-on. I want to use the one with the purple hair, I think, or maybe her. I don't know. We'll see. And then here are the full boxes. I think this kit is really beautiful and I don't want to bring in any foil, although that would be easy to do, but I want to just let the kit like be matte and pretty and I want to use as many of the full boxes as possible because I think they're all very pretty and I really like the colors in this like the navy or it's not really a navy it's like a, a dark teal with the green and the cream I just think it's really pretty we have some little deco up there I might put that at the top I like doing that now it's kind of fun and then we have some half boxes and then some more functional stuff on this page and some fancy labels and washi and then the bottom washi another full box so some of them are going to have to be edited out I think but we'll see and then I have the date covers I also have the date dots I'm going to use these as well just because they're there and they match the kit perfectly so there's that and let me show you the spread that I did at my main planner so this is my everyday planner and this is also a caress press kit that's funny but this is, see how I did the deco up here? I want to do that with this kit that I'm using today. But this was really pretty. I like this a lot. And I back planned quite a bit of this. So that's why it looks like so like spaced out and stuff. But I thought this was really pretty. And yeah, I think we're ready to get started. This was a good Christmas, despite me trying to sabotage myself as usual. But we'll get into that. So let's get started. Okay, so I'm starting with this bottom washi. I'm not cutting it down or anything because I think it's really pretty and the snowflakes are like real delicate and I just like them. This week was not very cold, so that's not really a reflection of what was really going on, but that's okay. It's what I wanted for the week. I'm just going through all of my glitter headers leftovers and looking for something that will work and I found some old ones from Sadie stickers. So I'm just using the date dots from the kit. I decided not to use any foil with the kit. I just don't, didn't think that it really needed it. So I'm just going with what I got in the kit. I really like the colors that this kit has. The mauve color with the green and the cream. It's really pretty. And then the glitter headers I chose are just a kind of natural color that kind of match it, matches that creamy color from the kit. So for the sidebar, I went with the little stockings with the fa la 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 la. Uh, banner above the top of them. I just think that's cute. And then below that I just put down a couple pieces of washi with the this week header and then at the bottom I put the little dog in. He's so cute. And then a half box above that for my favorite moment of the week. And then I'm just pulling in a little bit of deco to decorate that box. I don't ever really decide what I'm going to put in that favorite moment box until the week is like I've already planned the whole week. So I will come back and finish the sidebar in a moment. All right. On Monday, I put in a flag and I'm just marking that I am in Midland, which is where my parents live. And I just put in this cute little once more with love munchkin dressed up like a reindeer. And then below that, I put in that we went to the park. We walked over there with the dogs and my little nephew, and we just kind of hung out. We needed to get out in the beautiful weather. It was like 70 degrees that day. And then I just used a label to mark that it was Christmas Eve. And then here's a couple of pictures. Oh, I didn't have room for the one of my sister, but I did get her in my little vlog which you can watch on the plan with me for this week. It is up. It is the Home for the Holidays Caress Press Kit. And I did um, mark that I was vlogging for the first time. It was interesting. <laughs> and then below that is a picture of my dad and my nephew. 
And then on Tuesday, which was Christmas, I put in a label to mark that it was Christmas. And then below that, my nephew got a Tickle Me Elmo and he was a little bit scared by it for a second, but he loved it. And then I put in a half box because around lunchtime, I put without warning, my holiday meltdown showed up and yeah. Um, I put in this quote that says, that's the thing about pain, it demands to be felt. And I took out some frustration on my mother, who's the most patient person in the world to me. And we took a nap together and chatted and it was fine. We were good. But I don't know what happened still. I'll figure it out eventually. And then um, below that, I have a new ornament with my little nephew's hand. We have one from last year and it was so cute. And then below that, I put in a picture of us playing the game called Shit Happens and it was really fun. I looked for it again to play at our game night and I can't find it anywhere. So um, yeah, I'm gonna have to look for it because it was worth it. It was, it was a really funny game. And then at the top of Wednesday, so my sister was born the day after Christmas, so I'm just marking that, and I got her all Harry Potter themed presents. So I got her this, um, giant book. I don't know which one it was. Honestly, I don't know what number or anything, but it was like an illustrated version of it. And then I got her a candle that smelled like, it was called the London Candle, and it smelled like tea and lemon. Really, really good. And then I got her a little pin that looked like a wand and a bookmark so she can read her book and smell London and write notes with her wand. She enjoyed it. And then below that, I put in a uh, full box, and then we drove to Abilene. So our family Christmas, like our big family Christmas, is always in Abilene. We usually just stay for like one day. Um, we played apples to apples, but my boy cousins decided to totally play me. And I had the word sensual, and they played some inappropriate cards in front of our grandparents and it was embarrassing but also hilarious considering how conservative they are anyway they totally played me and it was a good memory <laughs> and then on thursday i'm just putting in some random pics of us or one picture of us um putting together a puzzle we always do a puzzle every year and this one was like relatively easy and then below that, I put in a half box to mark that we had our big family lunch at the country club. My grandparents are country clubbers. Um, I hate that picture of myself, not of my family. I love them. But I hate that picture. But it ended up being good motivation for me. And I was really, really motivated in the weekend. Um, or when the weekend came around to work on my 2019 goals. So it may have been a good thing in the end. But I had a long drive home marked that. I did stop someplace, but I, it was only for like a second. I had to get gas and then got back on the road. And then on Friday, I just put in a picture of my mom with my nephew and I put that I miss my family already. They are the best, which they are. They are ever so patient and kind and funny. And then on the bottom of Friday, I put down my video, that December haul that went up. And then that night, I was so exhausted, I didn't want to do anything. And so I just finished, um, oh, I'm putting down this picture of my cat who was still mad at me. Her face just is like, I'm so annoyed that you were gone forever. And we cuddled a lot on Friday and Saturday. She's snoring right now, right behind me. And then on Friday night, I just, I went to bed really early, but I did um, finish Real Housewives of Beverly Hills. I don't know what season it was. Whatever's on Hulu. And I put hashtag not ashamed because sometimes you just need some trash TV to get your mind off of things. And then 
the rest of the stuff on the weekend. So I did go ahead and put in this little laptop to mark that I had tons of filming to do. I wanted to get out a lot of videos the next week. So I filmed so many. And then I did go to Michael's on Saturday and got some fun things at Michael's, some new sticker books. And then I, on Saturday, or no, on Sunday, I spent a lot of my day working on my 2019 goal brainstorming and just kind of mapping out what I wanted to do for this next year. And so I put that I felt very focused and ready to tackle the new year. And I chose Renaissance for my one little word. And then over on the sidebar, I put despite my self-sabotage and some low self-esteem from that picture. It was a wonderful family with my Christmas, or wonderful Christmas with my family. And that my favorite moment was um, my mom loving on me. She loves me. And I am so grateful for her. So it was a good Christmas week. All right, here's my Christmas spread all finished. This really, really was a great week, despite my own struggles. And this spread is beautiful, and I really love this kit. It's really fun and kind of unexpected colors, with the mauvey pinks and stuff. But I love it. It's so cute. I kind of wish I had taken more pictures. I was more worried about, like, getting my vlog right, and I completely forgot to take pictures. I had lots of video. A bunch of these pictures are, like, fuzzy, too, because I just took them from frames of video but yeah lesson learned on that one definitely need to take more pics but this was a really cute spread and a great week and great times with my family so I will look back on this fondly um yeah I think that's everything for this video thank you so much for watching give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed it as well and subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel and I'll see you next time bye